What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Splatoon 3. This is going to showcase the side order DLC, which I believe will just kind of be its own series. I'm so excited about this. I really am. I've been looking forward to this for months now. I've been tweeting about it. I've been posting imagery about it on Twitter. I don't know if you guys have seen it, uh, but update. I've got an update says big man. What is it? What is it? Heads up, the game was updated. Okay, got it, got it, understood. More importantly though, rumor filet. That's a segment, sounds fishy. Would this be the rumor about the spaced out wretches packing in Gopolis Square? Yeah, I heard about that. Do you think it's true? I have seen fewer people from Ecopolis Square and Turf War punching the clock. Hey, you're right. Now that I think of it, what's up with that? Did they find out how rad the Splatlands are and throw in the towel? I know. We should go live from Ecopolis Square and get the truth. Big man, are you just angling for a way to expense a trip to Ecopolis Square? I just thought it'd be cool for our viewers to see another side of Ecopolis. <laughs> All right. And that's it for now. Ooh, spicy. From Splatsville, that's a wrap. Okay, I, what? So let's see, where are we gonna go? The trains even run to Incopolis Square. Although something fishy is going on there, your call whether you wanna get involved. And I do want to get involved, let's head there now. All right guys, so here we are going to ride the rail to Incopolis Square, of course, from Splatoon 2. Let's see how this goes. This is exciting, this is a brand new adventure. And, uh, you know, I like how the first update added uh, Inkopolis Plaza. This is adding Inkopolis Square. And something is going to be going on here. Things are chill right now, but get ready. I do want to thank you guys so much for your support, by the way. Uh, over 5 million subscribers. So many thousands of likes on these Splatoon videos. I really do appreciate it. Uh, I've updated ZachScott.shop uh, to refresh the shirts a little bit. We are dreaming. Okay, here we go. This is interesting. How is this gonna go? Hey! Hey, what? Oh, wow. This is so cool. Hey, hello! Up and at him, mate. Yo, eight, you awake or what? There we go. Wakey, wakey. Do you know who you are? I'm me. Any bruises? You seem good. No, <laughs> these are bruises? These aren't bruises. My whole body's bruised. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna stay with this. Let's see. What about a headache? You okay? I am great on my hair, honestly. I'm, I'm enjoying the hair as is. I don't want to change a thing. Can you see me? Things are looking good for me. Although I kind of like those. I just, yeah, I'm just going to keep it. Let's look. We're good. We're good here. That's the eight I know. Yeah. I guess so. Nice. If you hadn't come around, I didn't have a plan B. Now, why is Pearl a bot? That's that's gonna have to be answered, right? What's up? I've got something on my face. Oh, right, you wouldn't recognize me like this. I'm Pearl. You know, your bestie. <laughs> uh, no, for serious, I'm legit Pearl. Not sure how I got this way, but here I am. Not sure where Marina went either. She's supposed to be with me. Eight. Don't tell me you don't remember Marina either. It's cool, you just woke up. Might take some time for your head to clear. All right, there we go. That's regular me on the left, okay? And the one on the right is Marina. You got any idea where we should go from here? Marina's usually around to help me with that. Oh, duh, we should go find Marina. She'll know what to do. Duh. Come on, eight, let's get going. So. This, I mean, I really do think that this mode is gonna just kind of be its own series. I'm gonna look around, can I? Hold on, this is zoom. Okay, I'm just gonna swim in the sand. Looks pretty good. This is, uh, this is Splatoon, oh, this, this is Splatoon 2. This place kinda looks like in Goblet Square, but how to get like this? I don't know, maybe the whole order versus chaos thing. Marina, hello! Oh, Pearl. Marina, are you up there? Help him click. 
Hang on, we're coming up to you now. Shake a leg, eight. Marina's at the top of the tower. All right, let's figure this out. What's the menu you have? Okay. Settings. This looks cool. What is this? Are those lockers? I don't remember those being here. This is so cool. I do, you know, I wonder if this area is going to have, like, in, this mode is going to have a proper ending. Or or if it's just going to be, like, infinitely replayable. But the, the fact that this is almost like its own game is why this is going to be, like, a separate series for me. Is this for real? Uh, wherever we are, it's nothing like the Inkopolis Square Tower. I'm getting the heebie-jeebies. Keep your eyes open. Heads up, eight. Oh, yeah. What are these? What are these? Ooh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Trouble's coming for us. Use these. Thank you. I'll take these duallys. Let's go. You remember your way around a weapon, right? Press ZR to show them who they're dealing with. Ooh, okay, I almost got too close. We got more incoming. Incoming. So what's she, is she just kind of... I love, I love the ink. It's really glittery. Got it. Whoa, I think that was the last of them. Huh? Where'd I get the weapon from? I don't know. <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine. Just felt like something I had in me, you know? But never mind that, the elevator's running again. We can sit and scratch our heads all we want, but why bother when the answers are up there? Let's get moving, eight. Can I just jump into the water? Oof. Oh. Oh, put me there, it put me there. <laughs> all right, oh, that's cool. I wanted to see that. I wanted to see what that was like as soon as possible. Oh, I do have a special saved up. All right, let's get out of here. Or not saved up, but it, it can be saved up. Into the elevator, let's go. And who is it? <laughs> you with those fish we busted up? Sick of mate. No, I don't know. Cool it, I'm not your enemy. Just another bystander who got sucked in. I take it you two follow Marina's voice here. Say what, you know Marina too? All right. So wait, which one's the side order? And which one's the main dish? <laughs> had to say it, had to say it. First things first, I'm, what is it, Oct? Is that how you say it, Oct? Like Octo, maybe, Oct? As for Marina and me, we go way back. For real? Yo, lead with that next time. I'm Pearl and this is Eight. Cool meeting you, Oct. Uh, I've been in the area since I came too. All right, what else? I heard Marina's voice from up the spire, so I came to find her. I think I think my friend Yashi told me not to pronounce it Oct. But those bony fish found me first. I call them gelatins. That's why I'm trapped in this elevator. Uh, they are why I'm trapped in, the, in an elevator. The spire is crammed with gelatins. Uh, this wow. This wound they gave me hasn't healed, so I'm stuck. Yikes. Things aren't looking super good for the home team, huh? Don't count us out yet. I've been waiting for an octoling with a drone. Said your name was Eight. You're the one I needed to see. Okay, Pearl. Now check out what happens when you set this color chip into that palette. Palette? I'm supposed to know what that is? I don't even know what it is. Uh, oh, you're talking about this thing. So apparently it means eight in German. The CH is a G pronunciation, my friend Yashi is telling me. You got it, now set this color chip into it. Okay, but whatever happens is on you. Here goes nothing, eight. Slap that chip on in there. All right, I'll, I'll put it in. There you go. What do I do with this spare piece? Is this recyclable? Whoa, is it me or did your weapon get stronger? If you set a whole bunch of colored chips in here, you could walk all over those fishy freaks. No doubt, play your chips right and you could make it all the way to the top. Whatever's going on in the city, Marina's in the thick of it, or so I'm assuming. 
But this injury has left me sidelined. Our strike team will be limited to you too. Oh, just us? What about you? We're on it, Oct. I still don't know how to pronounce it properly. Deep breath, Sate. It's time to go find Marina. Oct. <laughs> All right. All right, hit the button for the top floor already. Love to, but this elevator only goes up one floor at a time. What? How come? You mean I gotta be patient? I'm in a hurry myself, but we play what we're dealt. We'll just have to take this a little at a time. Now then, we're almost to the next floor. Are you two ready? I'm ready. Let me in. Let me in. I'll beat them all, maybe. Or I'll lose. One of the two. <laughs> all right. First floor coming up. Easy. Wow. That is so cool. We're up to 1F. That's the floor right above the foyer. Each floor has an objective you need to clear. Take care of that and you can go up to another floor. Your objective here is to destroy that portal. All right. Also, the thing you set into your palette is a main damage distant colored chip. Now that you've set it, your ZR shots will do more damage from a distance. And there's a practice target right there. See for yourself how your shots do. Okay, so. Well, eight. You want to science it out or jump right into the mix? So, yeah, from, from a distance, it's a little more damage. So I guess that would mean if I were to like roll and then do that, it would do more damage. All right, so that cage will take you across. Ride the cage. Let's go. All right, no big deal. Maybe no big deal. It might be a big deal once I'm once I'm in it. Is this what is this? Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. They're being kind of aggressive. I have a max chain of, oh. Oh, wow, okay, let me refill that then. D now, it's on the ropes, is it? There you go, there you go, cleared. All right, that's not too bad. Get me out of here. And then I got a little reward there. I knew eight had it in the bag. Yeah, that was solid work. You're learning to make the most of your color chips. There are different kinds of color chips. You get one every time you head to a new floor. Here, I'll show you. So this one is poison ink. Increases the damage enemies take when they're in your ink, on your ink. What you're seeing is the next floor and details on the color chip you'll get there. All right. That color chip is poison ink. I tell you what it does, but it's all written there already. It's cool, no teacher like experience. Am I right, eight? All right. Uh, so yeah, home. Okay, sure. Now, do I need to do anything about it, or I don't have it? I only have this one. Okay. So, let's go. Yeah, go there. What if I say nah? Nah, I don't want to. So now we also have poisoning. So it basically, I'm just getting stronger. Home turf floor. All right. And, uh, I count three portals this time. Same drill as before, right? No probs. The poison ink color chip is nice. Says here, enemies take more damage while in your ink. Oh, word. I want to see. Shoot some ink around the base of that target there. So regular damage. But when it's on the ink. Oh, it's actually. Oh, okay. Good to know. Let's go. Now this is, I guess it's going to be like a rogue light or something. Wow, look at all the floors. Uh, hop up. Yeah, I'm off. Uh, what does this do? Ink bottle. Oh, pick up half your ink back. Okay. Uh-oh. Big guy. Awesome. Oh, boy. Uh, I'm just kind of chill. Oh, shoot. Get out of here. Oh jeez! Whoa! Oh man, I keep yeah, I keep. Is there a time limit here or one left? Now how does what, what if I just do this? That was pretty cool. That knocked a lot of them backwards. Awesome. Okay, cool. 
That went pretty well, too. And so we had Poison Ink. What's next? You two are handling this like pros. Maybe you do have what it takes to reach the top. I was going to ask about that. How come you know so much about this place, Socked? Fair question. Everything I'm telling you, I'm pulling from the elevator console. I learned this trick from the same place Marina did, though I won't blame you for being skeptical. For real? I guess it's true that Marina's a turbo nerd when it comes to machines. <laughs> if you went to the same school, I'm not surprised you can do the same stuff. Well, she was a few ranks above me. I wouldn't put myself quite in her league. <laughs> All right. By the way, here's your next colored chip. A uh, lucky bomb drop increases the chances of, of enemies dropping lucky bombs, and they explode from the closest enemy to the farthest. Okay, lucky bomb. Lucky for who? These lucky bombs appear when you defeat enemies. They explode on their own for big damage. Sounds great. I'm always wishing a bomb would show up to blow away anyone harassing me. <laughs> all right, lucky bomb drop. Let's try it now. The pallet. I mean, it's we're good. We're good. We got it. It all squared away. Okay. I'm assuming that we'll get to customize this all much later. And, and I don't know, like, again, I I, haven't qu I don't quite know the structure of this yet, so I don't quite know how to structure these episodes. But I just had a feeling that this is a totally different game, or, you know, totally different part of the game, and thus deserves its own series. Hey, you said lucky bombs explode on their own. Isn't that uh, kind of dangerous for eight? Nah, I shouldn't have hurt either of you just then. Why, are you worried? Hey, I believe in eight, just asking questions, you know. If you say it's safe, then bombs away. Huh? What's that thing? Looks from here like a canned special. Grabbing one will fill half your special gauge. Use You use specials by pressing on the right stick, remember? If you get mobbed, blast out with your reef slider. Alright, here we go. Oh, I can... Oh, I can fast forward it. Oh, wow. Okay, oh. Look, that's not... Oh, here. Oh, wow. So there's a chance that some of these bombs will come out. Oh, shoot! They're, they're behind me, too. I didn't realize they were going to be behind me as well. All right, there's... All right, it's okay. And that's gonna pop up soon. Oh, jeez. Okay, hold on. Whoa! All right, I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get away for a second here. She's targeting them. That takes up a lot of special. Where are they? All right, let me go get another special here. Uh-oh. Got it. Okay, I can see, you know, it's getting a little tougher, taking a little longer per floor. We cleared it. We got the lucky bomb drop. Good hustle, eight. I've got the lowdown on the next floor for you. Uh, decreases the amount of ink consumed by your main weapon. That's That would be awesome. Whoa, we get two color chips from this one? Twice. Twice is noise. <laughs> And it, oh, it's times two. Okay, I get it. So it'll be, okay. Hey, I've been wondering. It says reward there. What's that about? It's how much mem bucks you get from clearing the floor. Not sure what those are for yet, but they seem like a good thing to have. Well, if you say so, table that for now, I guess. Hey, when you need a break from climbing that tower, press that to let me know. I'll stop the elevator and wait here until you're ready. No sense pushing yourself past your limits. Oh, I'm, I'm pushing it all the way, dude. We're going to get these two ink saver mains. And the mim bucks as well. Got to take those. So this is good because I felt like I was kind of running low. So let's see what we got. I don't feel like I even need to test it. I think I just need to go. What gives? I'm not seeing any portals. Different objectives. This time you need to ink that zone and guard it until the time's up. So it's splat zones. Ah, kind of like splat zones. Yep, but I don't see a way to get uh, to that high ground with, with the zone. That wall... Buy it looks ink proof. Probably just need to glide from somewhere high up. That's where I come in. 
8. If you ever want to slow your fall, press B while in midair to hang on to me. You can move while hanging on to land a good distance away. That'll only work in octoline form. Really? So wait, only work in octoline? Oh, yeah, yeah, so... I gotcha, I gotcha, I think. Alright. So... Is it this? And if you want to grab on and glide, just jump and press B. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, almost. There we go. This might be a little bit better. Oh, that didn't do, okay, whatever. Okay, here we go. Much better, much better. Let's get this covered. How long? Not too long. Gross, those enemies coming over here are spraying their ink all over. That is a problem for me. Is there anything behind us? Because that would be annoying. So far, so good, though. We uh, Those enemies are pouring out. Okay, I, I'm not going to be able to read everything that they have to say, unfortunately, when I'm in the middle of the action here. All right, not too much longer, honestly. Let's special gauge up. So far, so good. Done. So far, I'm sailing through. I just wonder what this is going to bring to us. But the two Ink Saver mains are great. Oh, yeah, we're on a roll. You know, this drone body's not so bad if it means A doesn't have to do all the work. This next colored ship will help with uh, that, too. Use it right, and you'll be a powerful ally to eight. What does she get? Drone Killer Whale. It lets me use Killer Whale now. We're talking. Allows the Pearl Drone to use Killer Whale. Having two or more of this color ship reduces the required points accordingly. Okay, so I guess is that just going to be automatic when that happens? Like, you know, once it's filled up, she goes boom. Killer Whale time? I don't know. All right. Let's see what we got. New floor. Time to bust out the old Killer Whale. Uh, what? More like killer fail? What? No, you, you got this. Pearl, you can't use your drone features until the drone gauge is full. No kidding? Fine. Guess the drone gauge fills on its own after a while. Once it's full, look out, world! Actually, you don't even need to wait. Pick up that drone battery and it'll fill up some drone gauge. Now then, your objective here is to get that turbine tower to the goal. Oh, how do I do that? What the heck? A turbine tower, huh? Fastest way I know to make things happen is to shoot them. Okay, so I guess I'm just shooting the tower? Maybe? We'll figure it out. Can I go, like... All right. All right, hold on. I'm almost there. Oh, it moves much slower through the checkpoint. All right, so hold on. I'm, I'm trying to read what they're saying here. Is it, can I paint? Oh, how do I get up there? Eyes up, eight. There's some weird bouncy thing after us. How do we get up there? Can you use your killer whale yet? I think. How do I make it use the killer whale? There, they're using it. They're using it. Got it. Oh, and this thing has a bunt, a jump. Oh, that's the goal. It's moving a little bit backwards, so it's a little bit kind of like tower control, just different. Oh wow. Whoa! There you go. Get it in there. The checkpoint second. It's sweet time. But we got it. Awesome. Very cool. I don't. Yeah, that was that was great. We're about. To, uh, we're at about the halfway point. Cool. Can't believe all this is going down in the middle of our big world tour. On tour, are you? That tracks. You're some kind of musician, I take it. 
<laughs> yeah, Marina and I are off the hook. The world's most powerful power team. Huh, so Marina hit it big as an artist, did she? Pearl elimination something. Marina, hang on, girl. We're on our way. I did not like the sound of that. Let's pick up the pace. Yeah, good call. Uh, so next up, the main range. That'll be good because, uh, again, I'm feeling like I have kind of low range on this. So let's hit it up. See what happens. It says double zone floor. What does that mean? Two zones. Two splat zones. You just have to secure them both. I see disc pieces for the drone way back there. Put three of them together and you can give the enemy a taste of the, uh, the step off song. I don't know what that does, but I like the sound of it. Let's snag him if we can, eight. You, we got two main range color chips this time, right? That, that ought to help us keep him off our turf. Oh, I like it. I like it. Okay, let's go. I'm so afraid I'm going to fall off on the journey there. Can I shoot while I'm in the air? I can't, but I can hop off and start shooting. A little bit different. Zone secured. Let's get kind of everything covered here. Oh, what's this? What the heck is this? All right. I can only like swing once. Whoa! What the heck was that? That was cool. Very cool. Whatever you did, send everything around you flying. The portal's not looking too good either. Do we gotta beat up the portal? No, I think we just have to. Uh, so that we jammed the portal just 10 clicks left for this flat zone. That was really cool. Congrats! All right, that worked out quite well for me. Ba -da -da -da. We're on fire. Let's keep it moving and don't stop till we hit the top. Hmm, this is interesting. The next floor lets you choose your own objective. You get a different color chip for each one. All right, uh, let's take a look at these then. Different difficulties too. Well, you're the one with legs, eight. Which way are we going? So, okay, um, the, uh, hmm, I mean, this is a lucky chain maximum. The longer the chain, the more likely enemies are to drop items. What's the objective, though? I can't tell what the objective is. Uh, main ink coverage. Part of me wants to just go for it. Go for the hard one. I don't know if I'll do it every time, but I mean, this is my first opportunity to do so. I would hate to just lose here though. <laughs> but it would be funny. All right, here we go. What's, what's the goal? Portals, the color chip this time is max lucky chain. You wanna explain what a lucky chain is? There you go. Beating two enemies right after each other starts a lucky chain. The higher your lucky chain goes, the more likely it is that you'll see items or lucky bombs. So basically, we want to go on a splatting spree. Ha! <laughs> we were going to do that anyway. All right. Destroy the portals. Let's go. This may not take too long. Yo, something weird out in the open there. Yo, what is that? What is I see it too. Uh... Looks fairly harmless. Try touching it. Yeah, right. Hold on. I'm doing this first. There's one checkpoint. You're doing good. I am, aren't I? Oh, boy. Oh, that was cool. Oh, shoot. There's a lot of them now. Uh, I almost... Uh, Oh wow, that, that that thing's going. Oh wow. Okay, hold on, hold on. You know, I think I want to just go that way with it. Oh jeez. Oh wow. Okay, okay. Let's get it. I think I beat everything. And I'm glad I did hard. Now, I don't know I'll do hard every time, but I did hard that one time and it paid off. Things were a little more stressful, but we got the max lucky chain up. 
No sign of Marina on this floor either. I hope she's doing all right. She seemed a little burned out lately. I guess we've still got a world tour to finish, but after that, I promised her we could find a quiet spot together and take it easy for a while. So we got to save her fast. Sounds like Marina met the right people after she got free, but this is Marina we're talking about, so I expected as much. Yeah, this, this is Marina we're talking about here. Well, you know what they say, no one knows you like the folks you grew up with. Kind of true. Plus, Marina had to learn the language when she got to Greater Inkopolis, so you gotta figure she struggled to at least a little. I love to sit down and swap Marina stories, but this ain't the time. Every second we spend chewing the fat is the second we're not finding her. So true, so true. So up next, uh, dodge roll attack. Oh, so I gotta do them all. Okay, so yeah, I do want the main ink coverage. Maybe it'll let me do the next one, the dodge roll attack next. So I, I didn't know I was gonna have to do uh, you know them all, so. <laughs> Normal escape artist floor. So what is this? Is this just to defeat those guys? Huh, check me on this, but are those new enemies? They're gelatins, just like the rest. You only have to beat three to clear the floor. Yo, do they got wheels for feet? Won't that make them hard to catch? <laughs> well, whatever. You can take pretty much anything, eh? We've got this. It'd be funny if I lost here. Ride the cage. Defeat the fleeting foes. You can make the cage go faster by tilting. Yeah, I knew that, sort of. What does this do? That got one. All right, that was pretty cool. That might hit him. I, I, I wasn't sure how, which direction they were gonna move. They were freaking me out. All right. So, good job to me, huh? We're up pretty high now, huh? Bet we're racking up the color chips. See for yourself, you can press X to check your palette. One, two, three, wow, we got a bunch. We do have a bunch, the palette's looking good. Yo, what's up with the range and power stuff over on the left? Those are the color chip tones. Color chips come in tones based on their effects. Each tone has its own color and pattern. Reddish color chips are in power tones, so they mostly up your damage output. A once over at, at your palette will show you which color chips you're heavy on. Should give you an idea of where your strengths lie. And if you're done checking your palette, it's time to move on to the next floor. Yeah, looks pretty good. Okay. Can I do anything with this? I mean... They make different sounds. All right, sure. So yeah, now we do the easy one. <laughs> All right, go there. Let's see. I'll take the easy one. Let's do it. All right, rolling floor. So I went hard, medium, easy. I could have, I guess, easily done the opposite. Aw, oh, man, not those things again. Afraid so. You're going to have to get the infinity balls over to the goals. There's good news, though. The infinity balls won't ever fall off the stage, so knock them around as much as you need. Yes! Hear that, eight? You don't need to hold back. The new color chip is dodge roll attack, which puts a little bite in your dually's dodge roll. If you really want, you could push the infinity balls around using only those. In case you forgot, you do dodge rolls by tilting. Yeah, I know how to do it. How do you do it? There it is. All right, <laughs> that'd be funny if I fell off, though. I guess it's possible that I could fall off. All right, here we go. What's the plan, exactly? All right, we'll get one over there. I'll also move this one. Boom! That one might fly. There we go, that was cool. Hey, come on, we're gonna go this way. Just ignore those guys. We did it. Level 10. I'm excited. I'm excited. I did that one pretty quick. But level 10, I'm, I'm actually a little anxious because I would, I mean, I'm just like, what if I fail? <laughs> Heads up, we're coming to the top floor. That's where we will find Marina, right? Probably, though something about it seems different from the floors up to now. Eight Pearl, watch yourselves. What's this, Eight? Are they worried about us? Is something funny? Nah, you just sound like Marina when you say that. 
But enough messing around. Let's go find Marina. No holding back. Hey, this is it. All right, control room. Let's go. It's scary. I don't even get anything. Let's see what we're up to. Let's go. Control room. This doesn't even have a difficulty. Oh my gosh. That's Marina? What in the world? Let's go. Is that? No way. Wow. Marina! What the heck? Hey, Marina, yo, can she even hear me? Guess not. She's all tangled up in that weird machine. Oh, wow. Intruders confirmed. Commence grayscaling. Sit tight. We're going to get you out of that thing. Ready to rock eight? I think. I'm scared. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, the administration of order. That's a powerful barrier between us. So what are we going to do? Do we shoot these? Probably. Hey, don't, no, 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 don't shoot that. I need that. There you go. I am a little bit nervous about this. I'm gonna save my special for, uh, whoa. I like how she kind of shows us where things are. Where am I? What happened? How did I do that? Oh, there's a spring. All right, we got this one. All right, we're going around now. Yo, you still got two portals left. Whoa. Uh-oh, what is that? Whoa. Let me see, I think I touched this. Does that help? Got another one. All right. This might get us somewhere close. Actually, I'm, I'm too scared. I'm too scared to go in. Oh, she used uh, her killer whale. Oh, shoot. What's behind me? All right. This is it. Probably. All right. That's all of them, right? I think so. An unexpected barrier has risen. What does that mean? There we go. Barriers down. What 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 are we talking about? Are we attacking her direct? What is, what is this? Oh shoot 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 shoot! All right, where are we going? Uh oh. That was risky. I thought that would do a little bit more than it did. I'm just attacking her direct right now. Whoa! Hello. I like the musicality of this. I'm a little bit worried that my progress is gonna reset though. I'm hoping that she uses the killer whale soon. Got armor. That's useful. That was something. That was something. Look at her. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'll catch you. Oh, I did catch her. <laughs> I thought she was larger than that. It's Marina. Uh is that eight and pearl? What happened to you, Marina? Whoa, error, grayscaling interrupted. <laughs> Intruders, I was trying to do like a voice. Who's this fool? I am order itself, a consciousness generated from the processes of many who yearn. I am now fully realized, I therefore have no further use for a host vessel. All things will be converted to memory. Whoa. 
Oh, this is bad. The tower's shaking like crazy. Oh, wow. We got kicked out. <laughs> Nintendo presents. This is just the beginning, guys. I knew it. Here we go. That tower is going to change, I bet. Splatoon 3. Very cool. What an intro. Side order. Wow. Wow. Now what? <laughs> Now I think we're going to have to get a taste of the real game. I think that was just an introduction. <laughs> eight, eight, please be okay. Oh, thank goodness. Pearl, eight's woken up. It's me. Eight, thank you so much for freeing me. Surprised to see me in the flesh? Marina works some magic and bam, I'm back, baby. In fact, I didn't even realize she wasn't a drone anymore. But it's good to see them together again. I'm really, really sorry. It was the dramatic days in or Orderland module that stuck you in drone form and did all that other stuff, too. Say what? Dramatic days in... All oh, right, let me back up a bit. This is the Memverse. It's a prototype VR that is a virtual reality that I made. Your virtual reality? Hold up, you're saying we've been in a fake place this whole time? That's right. The only real things in the Memverse are our minds. That fuzzy cloud we met was order. It took control of me and caused this whole Memverse to go haywire. It's forcibly connected who knows how many people to the Memverse. Their minds are all in here now. Which is how I got pulled into all of this, I take it. Ah, I'm so sorry. I, I never intended for you to get roped into my mess. It's fine. We have other problems, like what to do about the situation we're in. You're absolutely right. We need to do something about order. Order's ultimate goal is a colorless world of order. Ugh. A place where nobody has a will of their own. They just do whatever they're told day in, day out. Order is using the Memverse to make the dream of that changeless world a reality. What's it beef with change? Actually, hold up. I thought the Memverse isn't real. Even if it gets what it wants in the Memverse, who cares? The real world stays the real world, right? Yeah, about that. Order is using what it calls grayscaling to neutralize the will of everyone that's trapped here. So if someone goes through grayscaling here in the Memverse, it has an effect on the real person. That about sum it up? Yeah. Anyone who goes through grayscaling will slowly start to lose their will in actual reality, too. And order is just getting started. It plans to keep pulling people into the Memverse. If we don't stop it, people all, all over the world will lose their wills. Life as we know it will be over. Yo, that sounds bad. Not on our watch, order. Again, I'm really sorry. This is all my fault. Nope. Nah, I know you had good reasons for making the Memverse. If that creep order hijacked your work, it's going to be sorry it ever tried. There we go. We're all gonna kick that loser out together. Let's do it. Aw, oh, Pearly, you say the coolest things. <laughs> all right. Yup. Yup, there she goes. Back in drone form. Nice. Don't worry, Aid. I got your back. Let's get this show on the road. So we are in the order sector right now. And, whoa, who is this? I don't even know. It's been a while since I played Splatoon 2. I could always play it. I probably need to play a little more Splatoon 1 before uh, that server thing goes offline. All right, I was just looking around. You know me, just just gazing. Marina's up there. Hey, 8, do you have a sec? Let's see what they have to say. I've been running some scans. Somehow Order jacked up the threat level and the Spire as high as it'll go. Why, it's got to... Well, why's it got to go and do that? And what does it mean for us? Well, for one thing, the spire is suddenly taller, but that's not the worst part. Run out of lives even once, and you'll get kicked out of the spire. And that'll probably happen since enemies hurt more. Okay, yeah, I'm seeing some challenges here. That said, I built the Memverse to begin with. I don't have to take this sitting down. Now that I'm outside the spire, I can hack the system, overwrite the changes, and lower the difficulty. Whoa, you can do all that? 
Glad to have you back on our side. Thing is, I'll need pearls <laughs> to get any hacking done. But you should have some pearls already, I think. I have 50. There you go. Those pearls were generated when you came out of the spire. Every time you leave, your colored chips and mint bucks will automatically be converted into pearls. So, like, we're probably going to bite it in the spire, but uh, if we kick some butt first, we get more pearls? And giving pearls to Marina for hacks to make it easier will help us next time. Even losing helps us win. I like this plan. Classic roguelike. Here are the settings I figured out how to hack so far. Want me to fix anything in your favor? Uh, let's start with max lives. Probably, honestly. Max lives would probably be the best. Uh, or damage reduction. Hmm. Let's do damage reduction. Get to hacking. And then we'll probably do, uh, that's probably all I can do. Uh, drone action slots. Oh, well, there's a lot. Oh, that's not too much. I think damage reduction might help. Maybe. I don't know. Drone action slots increases the number of action slots to set color chips for the pearl drone. Hacking is required to set any color chips for the drone other than the drone killer whale and drone splat bomb. So sure, let's do a drone action shot. Sure. All right, and I think that's all we can do in terms of hacking because I, I just have 10 pearls left. Even you'd have a hard time getting uh, to the new top of the spire, eight. But my hack should smooth the way. That's the best I can do from here. It'll be up to you to put a stop to order. One more thing. Here, eight. I have a pallet for you. Great. Oh, try switching weapons with the change pallet. Okay, this is Marina's pallet. One of those color chips go. Uh, one of those things color chips go into. Didn't know you had your own. Setting this pallet to your drone. I mean. Pearl will let you use a new weapon. I did some research and this doesn't seem to be the only other pallet in the Mimverse. So there's more pallets here. My early scans of those lockers over there show signs of other pallets inside. When you saved me, I found myself uh, with some keys for those lockers. You should have them, mate. So I got three keys. Oh, but you can't change pallets while climbing the spire. If you want to switch, make sure to press plus before getting into the elevator. Interesting. So it will basically be like me choosing a weapon each time. Open a locker. I just opened that one. Marina's dev diary. Okay. Hey, what's this? Yo, Marina, it's your diary. Shouldn't you keep this under lock and key? Wait, I guess you kind of did. Oh, well, maybe it's for the best. It's a little embarrassing, but if you two want to read it, feel free. You sure, Rena? I'm going to leave this with you, Aid. If you want to read it, you can do that from the menu on X. So, I'm just curious. How big is the diary? Oh, I am, I am super curious about this. The final fest is over and we lost. I feel so bad for Team Order. They tried so hard. But at the end of the Splat Fest, Pearl said we're going to take over the world. A world tour. Can you believe it? I can't wait. I haven't felt like this since I was on the sidelines for that battle right before I came to Inkopolis Square. It's off the hooks going on. If off the hooks going on a world tour, my schedule is about to be super packed. Uh, we've got venues to schedule, roadies to hire, new songs to write. Ah, I don't know what I'd do without Pearl. Uh, Pearl Uzuki Appreciation Corner. When I felt lost and directionless after deserting uh, from the Octarian army, it was Pearl that showed me hope. The two of us formed off the hook, and ever since, I felt like I'm waiting to wake up from a dream. Sniff, sorry, something's in my eye. Okay, I needed a good cry there. All better now. Now, I can't forget about the biggest item on my to-do list. It's not world tour business, but it's every bit as important. Project Memverse, name not final. That's what I'm currently calling my project to help eight and all the others uh, Kamab Kamabo Co. preyed on. Got to make it my, one of my top priorities. All right. So that's just page one, right? That's a sticker. Oh, a sticker for my locker. That's cool. So wait, is that... Is this just this? I, if, it feels like there's more to this, but maybe that's all there is for the moment. Gelatin Field Guide. Oh, Mimversal Beta Tester. That's a cool title. And then uh, this is all the stuff I've encountered thus far. There is more. And then um, Color Chip Collection. These are all the color chips that I've found for the moment. Oh, and I got some more pearls. I didn't know I'd get more pearls just by looking. And then these are not yet, you know, records, no records. All right, let's open another locker. A banner, that's sweet. Hey, a banner, they they put all kinds of stuff in these. We got the keys to opening more eight. 
We got one more key. Number three is something here. Uh, Agent Four's pallet. Nice. That's cool. What in the world? That's that's Agent Four's pallet. Oh yeah, Agent Four. Uh, who was that again? One of the new Squid Beak Splatoon members that Captain Cuttlefish introdu introduced us to. Oh yeah, the one who was supposed to be such a big shot. Uh, what's Agent Four's pallet doing here? Well, pallets are actually a representation of part of someone's soul. <laughs> I guess Order somehow pulled a part of Agent Four's soul into the Memverse, turning it into a pallet. What? For real? Man, we better keep this with us. Wouldn't want anything to happen to it. I'm still getting signals from other pallets in the lockers. Let's keep opening them as we find keys. All right, so we don't have any other keys at the moment. But I do now have 30, I guess, seven of these. I'm curious. Uh, we can ramp up our max lives as well, which I think would be a good uh, broken armor jump. Uh, that could actually be cool. I might actually, instead of max lives, I mean, max lives are kind of cool. Because, uh, yeah, let's do max lives. Let's not even debate it. I don't want to just die once and then not be able to... You know what I mean? So. That is... I think we are in a really good position now to, to move on into the spire. I don't know how long I can go on, though, uh, once we go in. But I think what we're going to do is next episode, we're going to jump into the spire again. And I'll put that episode out pretty quickly. And then, I don't know, we'll go through a couple times, depending on how long it takes, and have some serious fun. I thank you for watching. Thanks for subscribing. See you next time for more. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.